Welcome back to Space Weather News, your daily source for all things space weather related. If you enjoy our videos, please consider showing your support by subscribing to the channel. In the past 24 hours, solar activity has reached moderate levels. The most significant event observed was a long-duration M1.7 flare, which occurred at 27,234 UTC from Region 3388. This region has been classified as XO slash beta. Additionally, Region 3376 produced multiple sea flares as it transited the northwest limb. Some growth was noted in regions 3380 and 3386, while the other regions remained stable or showed signs of decay. No Earth-directed CMEs, coronal mass ejections, were detected in the available imagery. Moving on to the forecast, we expect solar activity to remain relatively low with a chance for M-class flare activity between the 28th and 30th of July. Now, let's turn our attention to the energetic particles. In the last 24 hours, the greater than 2 mega electron volts electron flux was within the normal to moderate range, while the greater than 10 mega electron volts proton flux remained at background levels. Looking ahead, we anticipate the greater than 2 mega electron volts electron flux to remain normal to moderate from the 28th to the 30th of July. Similarly, the greater than 10 mega electron volts proton flux is expected to persist at background levels during this period. As for the solar wind environment, it has been relatively stable in the past 24 hours. Solar wind speeds decreased from 450 km per second to 380 km per second, and the total field strength remains steady near 5 to 7 nt. The orientation of the magnetic field, as indicated by BZ, has mostly been northward. For the forecast, we expect a slightly enhanced solar wind environment late on the 29th of July through the 31st of July. This increase is attributed to positive polarity CHHSS, co-rotating interaction region and high-speed stream, influences. Moving on to the geospace conditions, the geomagnetic field has been quiet in the past 24 hours. Looking ahead, we anticipate quiet and unsettled conditions on the 28th to the 30th of July. However, on the 30th of July, we may experience active conditions due to the influence of positive polarity CHHSS. Thank you for joining us on this cosmic adventure through space weather news. Your support means the world to us, and we appreciate the many of you who have sent us your donations via the Super Thanks feature. If you want to further show your support and become an integral part of our journey, don't forget to hit that join button. By joining our YouTube channel, you'll have the opportunity to deepen your connection with us and help us continue delivering captivating updates and insightful analyzes about our dynamic universe. Thank you for watching.